Hawaii Volcano Latest, Shocking Images Reveal Moment Lava Flow Destroys Property. The property was located in the Kapoa region of Hawaii's Big Island, where hundreds of properties were destroyed by lava flows coming from Fisher 8. A camera set up inside the house captured the moment lava melted the glass of the windows, and spewed into the living room before engulfing everything in flames. Harry Kim, Hawaii County Mayor, commented on the destruction in the region, stating, If you combine the three of them, Kapoa, Vacationland and Lalani, we're talking about 600 homes. I'm talking about 600 families. Don't forget the farmers, don't forget the ranchers. Don't forget all the employees for them. An estimated 2,500 people have been displaced by mandatory evacuations across the island, with individuals in Kapoa, Vacationland and Lalani estates being the worst affected. In the space of just three days lava flows from Fisher 8, which measured half a mile across and 10 to 15 feet tall, buried hundreds of homes. The flows also entirely vaporized Hawaii's largest freshwater lake. Green Lake, and engulfed Kapoa Bay, extending the coastline about a mile from its original position. A spokesman for Hawaii County Civil Defense said, What used to be the bay is now all lava bed, new land, almost a mile out into the ocean. Approximately 160 properties in vacation land were destroyed, along with at least 330 homes in Kapoa Beach lots. USGS volcanologist Wendy Stovall said, Vacation land is gone, there's no evidence of any properties there at all. Betty Oberman, a 28 year vacation land resident, added, I just locked my doors and walked away. It's an emotional roller coaster. Looking to the future, Mr. Kim said the local government needed to provide better protection to local citizens. He said, Our responsibility is to try to work with the community to rebuild out of harm's way. However, he expressed his sadness at the destruction witnessed, stating, It hurts like hell. What we lost is the most beautiful place on earth.